never getting stuck like a car that you can't start. And by the time I released my third album in 2009, I kind of decided where I was at with my working. I was working at the convenience store just right off Cold Springs Road in Placerville. And I thought to myself, like, wow, I've been here for three years, and this was supposed to be a summer job just before I went back to school when I was in high school. And I'm looking at, like, you know, three years going by, and people are walking up to me in the store going, man, are you going to make this a career? Like, you've been here since the store, you know, the new owners came in. Are you going to be a career, you know, make a career out of this? I was like, shoot, I should, like, think about this. And my boss actually came up to me and told me uh, one of the customers that came in were like, yeah, there's a really cool school called Pinnacle, you know, it's, there's a branch in Sacramento, and that was perfect because I looked at the Art Institute, and um, what's the other ones? Um, the one at Full Sail in Florida, I looked at the LA Recording School, all these schools, and wasn't really ready to move at that time, and found the one in Sacramento was Pinnacle, and um, I signed up for there, in January of 2010 was when I started, and ever since then, I mean, everything's kind of been coming together, the teachers were great, um, and just to be able to pull everything together from what I knew to just kind of glue it, mold it together. And um, right now I'm working on um, my next album with a lot of the education I learned from there. And since I've been recording, I've been doing a lot of shows locally here at the Cosmic Cafe. We started here. Um, we've done them at cafes in Fair Oaks, um, Sacramento. We did a couple shows in Tahoe. Just recently did one with Snoop Dogg in Tahoe. Um, Around 2009 was kind of when I was like looking at trying to make a resolution. Like my 2000, late 2009, early 2010, my resolution of the New Year's of 2010 was like, I was like, well, I've been doing shows locally, but I want to do some shows for bigger venues in the area. And I thought that my resolution would be to do a show at the Boardwalk. And not even two or three weeks later, we did a show at the Boardwalk, um, opening up for uh, this group Tw Twisted and Potluck. And they're just like an underground independent, you know, group or whatever. And then not too long after that, we did good at that one. We got a show with Tech 9 And then after that, we were able to do a show with E-40. And um, not too long after that, we did a show with Brother Lynch, which is a, you know, pretty established artist in Sacramento. And then came the Snoop Dogg show. So it's all slowly fallen into place for us. And, um, and I'm also doing, you know, my solo thing as well as a group thing on the side. Um, and now I'm packing up to go to LA to try to pursue it and build a foundation to get a little further, take the next step. Don't change the way I ever know one. I'ma stay the same until the end, cause I'm never tripping. I'm optimistic. Things are getting better and I'm thinking I'll make it last. I'm soaking up all the positive, leaving the negative in the past. In other words, you could say that I've been taking out all the trash. I've been pedaling every day when you in the shade, laying in the grass. If you think this is the end of my road, then you dead wrong. I'm not gonna be another MC getting slept on. I feel good that I've been going to school to become an engineer in music, cause that's what I do. I've been paying my dues since my first album, and now I'm about to be changing my album. Come. People asking how come I'm not going by small Cause I'm all grown now and I feel I'll be wrong To a power that you fall for me to explain it to y'all If you're one of the few people that have been waiting for me to fall You'll never see it happen like you standing in the fall I'm just living for today and I'm gonna do it again tomorrow People hate when they can't get under Your skin they then tend to thunder For revenge but they will never get none I'm not tripping, I'm optimistic I never injured anybody and I